Hi friends, in this video I'm going to talk about one of the clean code practice, how to handle the constants and magic numbers in our code. For example, I've written a class called constant and magic numbers and then there is a method called calculate energy and it takes mass as the input. And if you look at this line of code, you can see mass into 300k. The question here is what exactly this 300k means? What is the meaning of this number? I don't understand. So the readability has been reduced. So this is not the right way how do we handle this expression so then what's the solution so i've written another method calculate energy with more expressive and it also takes the mass as the input and here you can see the 300k has been replaced with a constant name and it is light speed kilometers over seconds when i compare with the old method you can see at least the readability has been increased let's see some of its benefits so what are the problems when i use the magic number directly in my code First of all, it reduces the readability. Developer cannot easily understand by looking at the expression and it has more coupling to this magic number and then low testability because I cannot inject a different number to test this method and it is repeated code. Then what is the solution? The solution is whenever we handle the magic numbers or constants, we can rename the constant with semantic or give a meaningful and intention revealing names. Here for example, light speed kilometers over seconds. At least when I look at this, I can see what does this magic number means. And the second solution is replace the constant with parameters so that we can mock from the outside and we, it is very easy for us to test our methods with different numbers. So please remember to give a meaningful name for constant and magic numbers whenever you code. Hope this small information about the clean code is useful. All the best for your career. Thank you.